Hello and welcome back. We're going to keep talking about emotions today in the self-care coffee break number two. I love the work of Susan David. She uses uh, umbrellas to pull together different groups of emotions. We have an incredible number of emotions, about 3,600 apparently, and I don't know how they've measured those and whether that's absolutely accurate. But the gist is we have a lot and we feel on average a very small number of those in a day, 10 to 12 apparently. So I thought today what we would do is just explore our emotions a little bit more. And I want you to create for yourself, whether it's on this self-care coffee break or afterwards, six umbrellas. So you can easily draw a little arc at the top as an umbrella, the handle down. And I want you to pick six emotions that you're fairly familiar with. It might be some of these that are mentioned here, happy and sad, but there might be others, might be irritated, it might be joyful, whatever you want to have as your umbrella emotions. And just drawing those six umbrellas out, putting those words at the top, as you can see there, you can even colour them. We'll talk about those in another self-care coffee break. And then what I'd love you to do is find as many other words for that emotion as you can. So let me just read out some of Susan David's there for happy, thankful, content, comfortable, excited, elated. You might not have had all of those under happy. What would you put under happy? For me, I think I'd have smiley. I don't know if that's an emotion as such, but I know what smiley feels like. So I'm having that word under my happy emotion. Sad. If I put under sad, I might feel isolated, lonely. Under hurt, I might actually have irritated, let down. I'm sure you get the gist. So today for your self-care coffee break, I want you to start to really engage with emotions at a deeper level and think about and feel into the words behind the word. You might be surprised just how many words you can come up with. So I'm gonna leave that with you today. You can take the rest of the time if you want the full five minutes to draw your umbrellas. And as I said, if you want to um, colour those in some way, we will come back to colours and emotions at a future coffee break. I hope that's useful. Emotional umbrellas, I like to call that. Susan David's work, really useful way of getting in touch with our emotions at a deeper level. And I will leave that with you.